Hollywood is mourning the sudden death of producer Kevin Turin at the age of 44. The film and TV producer, whose work included hit projects like Euphoria and The Idol, died suddenly over the weekend, according to his father. Kevin's dad, Edward, tells Deadline in a statement, Kevin was so incredibly special. This world is going to be less without him. Kevin's friend Jay Penske also remembered the producer's legacy in a statement to Deadline, telling the outlet despite his many achievements in Hollywood, Kevin's greatest passion was his family and friends. He was so proud of his children. He and his wife, Evelina, were resolved that their children grow up with great values and ensured they make a difference in the broader world. He continues, our collective heart breaks for them, and we all feel such a profound sense of loss. We will miss Kevin so much, and this town lost one of its brightest rising stars today. No cause of death has been revealed. In addition to his work on hit TV series, Kevin was also known for a number of films, including Malcolm and Marie, and the acclaimed horror series X, Pearl, and the upcoming sequel Maxine. In 2022, at the South by Southwest premiere of his film The Unbearable Weight of Massive Talent, Kevin spoke with reporters about getting the film made, and he gushed over the film's star, Nicolas Cage. I mean, it's been um, since 2014, so where we first, where Tom first, you know, came up with this idea, so it's really kind of surreal. I mean, he's one of the more professional people you work with, and he kind of like, you know, it was always interesting blending between Nick versus the character of Nick in the movie, and they're very different people, but it was kind of like interesting how we would like process the two and kind of melt the two and make something totally unique and fresh. It was, it was kind of kind of delightful. Well, I think it's an iconic movie star, you know, from like, you know, who we love so much, being able to like, I think the film works on a pure like entertainment level, I think it works on an emotional level, and I think it's a movie that like, He's one of our, I mean, one of the actors who has the most range of anybody alive, and you get to see like every facet of him in this film. I mean, if you like him, it kind of pulls the full spectrum of Nick Cage you see in this movie. Kevin is survived by his wife, Evelina, and two sons, Jack and James.